Next year, we'll celebrate two centuries of diplomatic relations between the U.S. and Brazil. All that 200 years, I'm not sure the ties have ever been more important than they are today. We are the two largest democracies in the hemisphere. And our partnership has been a key force in upholding principles of rule of law and democracy. Our countries are working together to build a brighter, healthier future for our planet. I'm greatly honored to serve as ambassador uh, of Brazil to the United States. And it is also a personal pleasure for me. And it is with great enthusiasm that I take up the task of helping to strengthen the Brazil-U.S. relations. And I'm glad to be able to count on the Wilson Center and the Brazil Institute as a partner in this endeavor. We uh, believe that our two countries are also uniquely positioned to build an even stronger partnership in responding to some of the challenges that we face in the region and beyond, such as climate change. I would like to highlight maybe four areas, among many others, that I see as um, very important and uh, where I believe Brazil and the United States can pursue concrete results in the short and medium terms. First, to support closer cooperation in fighting deforestation and climate change and in promoting the bioeconomy. Uh, the second area I'd like to highlight is um, the idea of undertaking specific bilateral projects that could uh, promote supply chain resilience in key industries, such as semiconductors, clean energy, critical minerals, and pharmaceuticals. And third, we would like to encourage further measures to strengthen bilateral trade and investment flows in general, with a view to supporting even greater private sector participation in our partnership. And fourth, uh, there is a, a very good prospect of expanding and deepening our cooperation on a broad range of human rights issues, including the fight against racial discrimination and inequality.